Is Richard Horvitz the voice of Uka Uka from Crash Team Rumble? Let's talk about it. Now, six days ago, they revealed the trailer for the first level of Crash Team Rumble, and honestly, it looks really good. But whenever you collect enough Wumpa fruit, I think, it shows you standing on a hologram. A hologram with Uka Uka on it, and this is the sound effect it makes. If you don't know, that's the sound effect of Lonnie Lowly from Crash Bandicoot 4. It's about time whenever you get him. So you could play as him with his powers. And yeah, that's the sound effect it makes. So maybe Richard Horvitz is. The voice of Uka Uka from Crash Team Rumble. Who knows? We won't know it from Crash Bandicoot for It's About Time because Uka Uka never talks. The entire game, he is silent. Well, he's silent, but he makes a few noises. But the voice actor for Uka Uka wasn't credited at all in Crash Bandicoot for It's About Time because he didn't talk the entire game. He just made some noises. That's why he wasn't credited. So we won't know who does the voice of Uka Uka from Crash Team Rumble. And also, Canadian Guy A posted a video about how Activision is treating Spyro right now. By using a clip of, you know, Crude's new age. But actually, it's not a clip of Crude's new age. He's just lip syncing to the audio of Crude's new age. He lip syncs to the audio and shows what it is in Activision of what they're doing to Spyro. Is that they're treating it terrible and... They showed a picture of, they showed a statue of Crash Bandicoot, and and he says right here, like that thing from Crude's New Age is the best thing forever. And then you know the part where the you know the char- the other character says I'm hungry, and then he goes in a minute. That scene, yeah, he lip syncs to it. So, looks like Activision is more focused on Crash Bandicoot than Spyro. And that's all for today. Thanks for watching.